I have enjoyed the benefit of mentoring. And I'll tell you, it's preservation of destiny. Sometimes, when I, when I remember some of the conversations that I've had with Dr. David Edipo, I, I laugh all by myself. And I'm just grateful that I was not left to myself. One day, our church was still very young. And we were searching for a, a property to move into. So we, we found one. We had not paid yet. We found one when, we, when I went to him and told him, oh, we found a place. Um, we're about to pay for it. And in fact, as soon as we move in there, we have some strategies. I have some strategies that we're going to execute for growth. He said, fine. Like what? I said, as soon as we move in, the first thing we're going to do is to do 21 days prayer and fasting. He said, good. He said, but wait a minute. What's the longest fast that you and the church members have gone on as a church? I said, well, seven days. Seven days. I've led them on prayer and fasting for seven days. He said, good. How far is this new place from where you are? Where people have to take commercial transportation, maybe get on the bus before they get there? I said, yes. He said, okay. So the likelihood is that some people around where you are now may not be able to go with you if they're unable to pay because it will cost them money now. I said, yes. Okay. He said, well, what would you say has been the major attraction for your church up until now? I said, it's the word. It's the teaching, sir. I said, good. He said, so um, when you move into that new place, you'll be trying to get some of your old members to come along with you and you'll be trying to get some new people from the new environment to join you. I said, yes. He said, if I were you, what I would do for 21 days would be what has been the major attraction of the church. I said to, he said to add 21 days prayer and fasting with the inconvenience of coming to your new location. I'm not sure if that's going to be a fantastic strategy. You know what, as he was saying that, I was smiling I didn't tell him what I was thinking. I was thinking to myself, why was I thinking like that? <laughs> Mentoring delivers you from mistakes, delivers you from your ignorance.